Welcome to NTV at One. I am Priscilla Regina Naloga. Now today, the rest of the world is embracing World AIDS Day with a view to looking out to reduce infections, while also looking out for the best interests of those impacted and infected. One of those looking to express themselves today is a young lady living with HIV AIDS, Shanura Jimbo, and she's also Miss Y Plus 2024-2025. Good afternoon to you. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine. So tell us who you are. Uh, my name is Jimbo Shanura, Miss Y Plus 2024-2025, and the National SRHR Girl Champion 2024. Mm -hmm. All right, Shanura, let's talk about prevention. What needs to be done to make prevention more effective, especially for young people? For prevention to be more effective, we have to go back to the grassroots going back to the communities. For us to combat HIV by 2030, we have to combine both the science, the policy, and the activism. And that means community engagement. So we have many products on board, like the PEP, PrEP, uh, the Dapirin Vaginal Ring. Mm -hmm. But do the people even know about these products? Do, do like they even understand these products? Uh, do they even know the myths and misconceptions about them, how to use them, and even the side effects? Because you find that people drop off, off like PEP and PrEP just because they have got some side effects. Mm -hmm. So we need to go back to the community engagement and speak to those people. The insights they have about the different HIV prevention technologies available in order even to combat the stigma and discrimination. Okay, uh, you're a young person. Let's talk about future forward treatments that can actually help you to live a healthier life as an HIV person. Uh, the best treatment that we can have is inclusion. If young people living with HIV are included in different policy involvements in the country, uh, they are included by the family members when there is no stigma and discrimination in the community. Young people can stay on their treatment because you find that medicine is there in the, in the hospitals, it is there, there are counsellors, but then that young person comes from the council room mm. and then goes back to the community or the family where they are discriminated. So the best treatment is inclusion and uh, diminishing all the stigma and discrimination that these young people face. Okay, I see you wearing the tag Miss Y Positive 2024-2025. How has this initiative helped young people to embrace their status? So this such, uh, the Miss Y Plus, is a representative for young people living with HIV in the country. And this calls me to champion for advocacy for those young people living with HIV, mm -hmm. representing their different ideas that they have towards the different policies and community towards HIV, representing them in bringing out the challenges that these young pe people face. Because we find out that young people living with HIV face many challenges at home, schools, workplaces, but who is there to hear about these challenges? Mm -hmm. So. I'm here to represent these young people living with HIV, the challenges, advocate for them, and also encourage peer support among these young people living with HIV, okay. acting as an example. All right, in closing, uh, Jimbo, you, uh, you both statistics show that now our demography is by and large young people, up mm. to 50% of that. I want you to look in the mirror, I mean the camera, and talk to that young person uh, who's probably living a reckless life. They think that the future is theirs, and yet they may fall a victim of HIV AIDS. Mm -hmm. What's so your message of hope? As a young person, let me start with those living with HIV. HIV does not define who you are. You are more than HIV, and you can become anything that you want to become. Just stay on your medicine, adhere, um, attain you equals you so as you don't transmit the virus but everything is okay HIV does not define who you are and for those that are negative please take up these prevention technologies available there is PEP there is PEP and there is condoms take up these prevention technologies available so as you are protected from the virus so as you don't get infected because the world needs you Okay, all right. That is uh, Jimbo, who is Miss Y Positive 2024-2025. Thank you so much for being an ambassador. Thank you so much. All right. Uh,